Hi everyone, thanks for tuning in. This is a reading for Scorpios, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs and also cross watchers as well. Thank you everyone for watching. Hope you guys are good, doing well. So let's jump into this reading. Let's see what spirit wants you to know during this time, what you should be aware of, what you're being protected from. So let's get... The tarot, the free card spread. So we've got three of swords in the current energies. Six of cups influencing this situation. And we've got knight of wands in the advice position. Okay, so let's clarify. Dig a bit deeper. We got justice, Libra energy, we got the star, Aquarius energy, we've got eight of pentacles. Further clarified with ace of wands, page of wands, and knight of swords. Okay, so this reading seems to be picking up a situation that you have with someone from your past. We have the Six of Cups here. So uh, this is showing me that you have history with this person here. Yeah, you have history with this person here. Um, it looks like they still feel a connection with you. This person still feels a connection with you. You guys are separated, I can see here. You're separated from this person, Three of Swords. Yeah. I can see there's heartbreak and sorrow in this situation. So, uh... Yeah, it's due to it's due to the lack of justice here. Justice is in reverse. The lack of justice in this situation. Someone's not playing fair. So yeah, you're dealing with someone from your past here. You got a connection here with someone from your past. Um, I feel like For some of you, you may have thought that, you know, you and this person may have a new beginning. With this Ace of Wands. Yeah, but um, it doesn't look like... This is why there's heartbreak here. I don't know, someone's heartbroken. Yeah, I can see someone's heartbroken because I feel like they were expecting someone was expecting maybe a new beginning here in this situation yeah but uh justice is in reverse someone were playing fair here so this is why there's heartbreak in this situation yeah someone was someone's being deceitful being dishonest here yeah looks like there's probably like cheating there's a third party situation this is why there's uh, someone else in the picture here it's a third party situation so yeah this is someone that is being deceptive here yeah for some of you yeah you're dealing with this with someone in this masculine energy there's a masculine energy here knight of wands you're dealing with someone um It looks like they're seeing someone else here in this situation. Because there's a third party interference here. Three of Swords, there's a third party interference. So it looks like, uh, yeah, this Knight of Wands, this, this is someone that is seeing someone else. There's someone else in the picture, I feel... Because uh, they're in this energy, 
Knight of Wands. They're in this Knight of Wands energy, which is, you know, the energy of someone that is quite promiscuous. They're very flirty, you know, so uh, they like a lot of attention. They tend to have this the energy of someone that tends to have um, multiple sex partners. They like a lot of attention. They're very flirty, in and out energy. Yeah, they might have fire in their chart. You could be dealing with an Aries, Leo or Sagittarius for some of you. We also got Knight of Swords here as well. Air sign. Could be dealing with someone with air in their chart. Libra, Gemini or Aquarius. Yeah, for some of you, I feel like, you know, with this star here, you know, I feel like... For some of you, you may have felt like a strong soulmate connection here with this person. Some of you may be disappointed. This person may be disappointed here. Because I feel like they feel a strong connection here with you. With the star energy. Six of cups. Yeah. Someone here wanted a new beginning, page of wands. I feel like this person wants a new beginning here. They want to reach out. But yeah, there's a third party interference here. So it's like this person's missed the opportunity. They missed the opportunity. I feel like they want to reach out. This is someone that wants to take action towards you. Got two knights here. They want to take action towards you here. But <clears throat> I really feel like there's a third party interference. This is what I'm getting. This is someone dealing with someone else. There's someone else in the picture here. For some of you, you may have blocked this person here. Because this separation looks painful. You may have blocked this person here. You focus on work. Eight of Pentacles. I feel like this is someone, you know, because uh, they're just in this Knight of Wands, flighty, flirty energy. I feel like they get they get karma for how they dealt with you in this situation. Yeah, because with justice in reverse, I feel like this is someone that is uh, yet to give you justice in this situation. And they avoid it. This is someone that avoids confront confrontation. I feel like they avoid dealing with the situation with you they don't like to confront situations this is the type of person you know that runs away from from dealing with situations here they try to avoid it here because they're just in this night of wands energy it's like i don't really feel like this person's like looking for you know commitment right now so like they just want to have fun during this time yeah they're very promiscuous this is someone that just wants to hook up with someone you know and have sex and have fun really it looks like this is why justice is in reverse this person is just not doing right and I feel to say that uh, for some of you, this person knows what they're doing as well. You know, they could be doing it on purpose as well. Avoiding the situation with you, you know, to play games here. This is someone playing games with you. Yeah, they could be doing it on purpose. This is why they're going to, this is why they're getting karma. Because I feel like with this star energy, I 
Like, you're getting blessed here. I feel like you're getting blessed here with this star energy. Like I said, you focus on your work. So I feel like, you know, for some of you, you've you've blocked out this situation here. And you're focused on your work. And it's like, um, I'm getting glow up. Some of you are getting a glow up. You're going through, you know, you've had a glow up since you've been with this person. You know, I feel like since you've been with this person, you've had a glow up since. You're working on yourself, your career, your goals. You, you know, you're standing out right now. I feel for a lot of you, this person wants to return back to you, it looks like. They want to come towards you during this time because you're shining right now. You've had a glow up. This is why I feel like they want to reach out to you. Okay. But at the same time, this is someone, they know what they've got going on. This is what I'm saying. This person knows what they've got going on, though. They know they're seeing other people. There's someone else in the picture. There is a third party here. Yeah. And for some of you, I feel to say, you know, it could be someone of the same sex as well. They could be seeing someone of the same sex, a secret gay lover or something. Because we've got two knights here. Knight of Wands and the Knight of Swords. Two masculine energies. So this is same sex situation here. I'm seeing. I'm seeing that for someone. I've been seeing that a lot in these readings. I'm gonna keep picking up that energy, the same this same sex energy. Maybe this is something that spirit wants you to be aware of. You know, because we've got justice in reverse. This is someone that is being deceitful. They're not being honest with people out here. So they want to come back towards you, I feel. Because they see you glowing up, you know. Shining out here. Some of you could be like a celebrity or something. You're well known or, you know, what you do for work. Gives you a lot of um, attention. You get a lot of support. Fame. Whatever it is, you're shining out here. You've got people's attention. This is all I can see. You can, you've got people's attention and you've got this person's attention. You know, so this is why they want to come back towards you now. Maybe try and flirt with you as well. They're going to try and flirt with you, I can see. With all these ones energy. Yeah. This is someone that's thinking with their dick. This is a masculine that thinks with their dick. You know, they have one thing on the brain. Yeah. They may have sex addictions. This is someone that's very promiscuous, you know. They think with their dick. So, yeah, I feel like this is what it is. However... Uh, with this justice in reverse, I mean, this is someone that's dishonest. I don't feel like they're going to come and tell you what's really going on with them. They're not going to tell you what's, what they really got going on. Yeah, for some of you, this person, with Ace of Wands in reverse. This person, they may have STDs or something. Yeah, because they're very promiscuous. They're not going to tell you everything. Yeah, at the bottom of the deck, we've got the moon. There's secrets. This is what I'm saying. There's things hidden in this situation. They're not going to tell you everything. This person doesn't want you to know everything. But the moon's in reverse. So the truth has come to light. What's hidden is coming, coming to light. What's in the dark is coming to light here. I feel like what's hidden has been revealed Secrets have come out here. But for some of you, this is what I'm saying. I mean, this you may not. This person's sexuality might may have been a secret. They may try to keep it a secret from you. Maybe you didn't know this is someone that likes same sex. That likes the same sex. But I feel like for some of you, this person likes the same sex as well. They try to keep that hidden from you. But it's out. I feel like I feel like it's out. The truth is out. Yeah, five of swords. 
there's conflict here in this situation. Yes, I feel like this person, they're just playing games. They're playing mind games out here. Because, yeah, there's three people in this card here. So, yeah, there's definitely third party, third party here in this situation. They're not going to keep it real with you. Yeah, you're leaving. Eight of Cups. You're leaving the situation. Yeah. You are leaving the situation. Yeah, this person is a liar and a cheat. Seven of Swords. This is what I'm saying. They're just a liar and a cheat. This person is just sneaking around. Up to no good. Out here. Yeah, Ace of Swords in reverse. This person's up to no good. They're a liar and a cheat. They're dishonest. So I feel like, you know, if you hear from this person, they're not going to keep it real with you. Yeah, they're not going to keep it real with you here. Yeah, Four of Pentacles. They're holding back. Yeah, they're not going to keep it real. Yeah, Nine of Swords. Stressed. This person, they can't sleep at night at the best of times. Yeah, it's over. We've got death, Scorpio energy. Yeah, major changes taking place here in the situation because secrets, what's been hidden is coming to the light now, you know. I feel like you you know the truth of this situation. You know the truth of this person. You know what they're about. There's something that's making you just walk away from the situation here. Yeah. And this, this person can feel it. They can feel you leaving them behind because you are out here shining. You're glowing up here, looking like a star. This person is seeing you, like, leveling up. And they can't sleep because I feel like they're getting karma. I feel like this person gets karma for making the wrong decisions, making poor decisions, you know. And the, their decision... To avoid this, this situation with you. Is bringing them karma. Yeah, things ain't going well for this person. They can't sleep at night. They got a lot of stress and anxiety here. Things not going well for this person. Like I said, they may even have STDs out here. And all sorts going on. Yeah, because they're probably out here, you know. Having sex and not using protection, you know. Yeah, having anal sex, I'm hearing. I'm getting that strongly. For some of you, I feel like this person tried to hide their sexuality from you, but it's coming to light. You know, I think Spirit really, really wants someone out here to know this about this situation here. Because I've been getting that energy a lot in these readings. I don't know if I've got a regular viewer that, that I keep picking up their situation, but <laughs> some spirit wants someone out here to know that this person here is up to no good behind the scenes here. And this is why they avoid this situation with you. Yeah, they're getting karma for it. This is what I can see. Their karma is actually watching you level up and move on with your life, you know? Yeah. I feel like they're going to attempt to try and come back towards you here and try to uh, maybe flirt with you or something. Yeah. Court issues. This is someone that's facing court. You gotta go to court. Yeah, I stalk your social media daily. Yeah, they're watching you glow up, boy. They are. You are shining out here. You must. Maybe you got a platform or your social media. You know, they're watching your posts, what you post. But they can see. This is someone that can see that you are leveling up out here without them. Yeah. Yeah, DL, bisexual, yeah, I knew it. This is someone that's on the DL, they're on the DL, yeah. Try to keep their sexuality secret here, but I feel like it's all coming to light. 
Yeah, fake social media accounts. That is the messages, you guys. I hope it gave you clarity. Thank you for watching.